Well, hello and welcome. My name is Ryan Fazan, technical consultant from Tyler, Spain. Uh, I'm here today with Jose Cantavella from Natuther. Um, Jose, thank you so much for joining me and uh, the show. Thank you. Thanks to you, and it's always a pleasure. No, it's fantastic. Um, it's unfortunate that we're not getting to see each other in person. I always, I always love chatting with you at the shows, but uh, at least we get to do this, and I get to invite everyone that's in the Spanish pavilion here at Coverings to go see Jose and Jose Manuel at uh, the Natuther booth um, just around the pavilion here. So, Jose, I want to talk to you about everything that's going on with uh, Natuther this year and, and the novelties that you're bringing out, because I see you've actually introduced quite a few this year. Yeah, um, we, we, we have it. Uh, thanks for the question. This is, this is true. We have it. Uh, I don't know if it's a good look or bad look, you know, the year that we passed it, you know, the pandemic year, that we, we have it too much time to think, to create, you know, and uh, that was the good point, you know. That we have uh, too many ideas, you know, in, in our hands and uh, in, in our mind. Excuse me about 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 uh, the, the novelties that we can we can uh, create for the new show. And we was expecting this is the first show after the last that was February 2020, yeah. February so it was Sevisama, a long yeah. time. And of course, during this time, we, we introduced new items in the market, but it was. Uh, not as we was expecting, okay? Because uh, the expectation always is is to present it in in the correct show, okay? Ambience with the so uh, this year we go with some of the novelties that we introduced last year and uh, a lot of new items that we are we are uh, we develop and we are going to show in in coverings. And I mean that cre that creativity is is really the heart and soul of of Natuther. That's that's what I love about about your company, and especially the uh, the play that you do between the periods in in history and ceramics history and, and creation. And um, so, you know, I wanted to ask you about that that history of of ceramics in the Castellón region and how you can how. I think you're one of the masters of employing a blend of traditional ceramic um, chemistry and, and modern technology. How are you developing uh, using traditional techniques and, and modern in, in your new programs for this year? So, uh, yeah, we, we, like, uh, we like the old history in ceramics, okay? We, mm -hmm. we love from where we are coming, okay? Uh, and it is really important to know where we are going, okay? So um, uh, we have two factories, okay? Uh, the large factory or, or, or large factory produce practically everything extruded. So it's, as you know, it's our old traditional production process, but uh, with, uh, we, have, we always try to make it new concepts of, of modern look, uh, new glazes technologies that uh, join together with the old techniques helps apps uh, to, to produce with uh, really, really un unique products, okay? That uh, techniques of extrusion offers to us uh, to show the market examples large, uh, like for example, large steps uh, to combine uh, with a minimal, minimalist uh, areas and shame. Uh, sorry, I have, <laughs> excuse me. Uh, with uh, okay. a lot of special, special pieces of, pull uh, copings and special pieces that helps, you know, to make it all the combination of inside and outside in, uh, in, the, in the houses. And our second factory that is, is our, our baby, we can say like that, okay, that we My create, place. A lot, <laughs> is, a, is a lot of places that uh, we, we make it, uh, we, in this second factory, we produce practically 50% extruded product. And the other part is press tiles, but always trying to find the uh, special pieces, okay? And the unique in colors, in glazes, and in technologies, okay? For example, this year we are going to, to present it in, in coverings one new collection. It's going to call Thika. It's a four by four. It looks like a that. handmade tile. And yes. uh, we, uh, Make, we take it one, one uh, technique that was using here 100 years ago that mm -hmm. was made by hand, okay? It's like a brush, okay? 
Yeah, that. Uh, but before, of course, by way, by, way, by hand. And nowadays, we make it. We make a machine that give us the same effect. Like uh, you take it a uh, product, you glaze it, and then you move the glaze by hand. Okay, so mm -hmm. produce really unique effects in the product. Uh, and yeah. then, of course, another special thing in our second factory is all the three-dimensional pieces that we are doing. Okay, uh, special porcelains and mm -hmm. use the unique glazes like crackles or uh, glazes that are unusual in the, in the market. No, that's that's very cool. I mean, and like we're seeing we're seeing a bunch of really unique color palette sort of that started to emerge in 2019. Um, and, and I'm seeing a lot of it coming out in, in your novelties that you started at Evisama, we started to see again a lot of those really unique glazes, metallics, and, and crackles in um, a much broader range of, of colors. Your uh, the wall tile that you introduced in, in Evisama, the Evoke, uh, had a really really neat range of colors. The new one that you're you're introducing still does. So it seems like Natuser has has really embraced this sort of um, bouquet of colors that were that started to emerge in 2019. Is that something that you think you're going to continue with in, in your novelties this I, year? Yeah, uh, we we are a factory. We are a strange factory, I can imagine, <laughs> because we love colors, OK? We, yeah. we understand it's, it's strange because, you know, uh, everybody, when making a collection, of course, white, beige, and gray are the three colors that everybody is safe colors. Yeah. And but we always like to play with colors. Okay, we have collections that that, uh, for example, we have it more than twelve years in the in the catalog. Nobody take care, and the last year was a really vibrant colors. Okay, really deep colors, and was amazing how it was selling because the people. I think last year, uh, the pandemic. I think moved to the market to certain colors. Okay, colors like of course I I don't want to talk about the. Neutral colors, white, beige, and white and gray, because this is always. But there are uh, some colors that people want to to be a personality in the colors. Okay, mm -hmm. colors like like green, deep green, deep blue, or the the terracotta color. Okay, that looks really the natural clay of the tile. Okay, yeah. are colors that that are really really trendy uh, in the market, and uh, people are really really supporting this one. Okay. Then other pastel colors like uh, baby pink or something like that, that is, it's coming back again to more very soft blue. But uh, I showed last year that it was really uh, special, the, the deep colors, uh, especially this, I can say three colors, blue, green, and the terracotta. Uh, yeah. This was the, the main uh, colors that was, was the strongest. And another was more the color or the trend how was uh, that we we feeling last year? We are specialized in terracotta looks or cotta looks, okay? Mm -hmm. And we show last year that uh, okay, our sales of terracotta was always uh, normal, okay? It was a a, a, a certain uh, part of the of the market, really small. Yeah, it was stable, but stable, really stable. Okay, it was a niche market, but last year for us was was a boom, was a boom. I don't know if the uh, talking with several customers, they told me that uh, the the final customers they was looking uh, really uh, when they arrive at home because you you be a lot of time last year everybody was much more than we was yeah. expecting at home. Okay, yeah. Uh, yeah. everybody wants to be outside, <laughs> but we must we 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 follow the, the instructions of our government. Okay, and we were a lot of time at home, and the people yeah. I think they want to be at home like comfortable okay great colors are a bit frozen homes okay yeah. the colors are, are, are warm uh, when you are at home and you are with a you know these uh, colors that are warm mm -hmm. the people feel more comfortable okay and i tell you that uh, that a lot of customers and was asking about cor terracottas and co and, and cotta colors okay that was the the some of the colors that uh, we, we have it. Okay, this one, we cannot consider a, a color because colors, you know, but uh, when we were talking before, like a terracotta color, okay, it's affecting as well to the floor tiles because uh, a lot of people was looking that 
that's mm -hmm. really the call. Okay. Yeah, I started to see that myself, in, and uh, I'm sure that that was that was a big thing for for your company. I mean, I remember back when I got my start in the industry, one of the first tiles I sold was uh, a Natuther 12 by 12 with the little Estrella tacos. Correct. Um, and, and that's going back almost 30 years now. <laughs> um, it's true, it's true, it's true, right? It's like that, yeah? the, people, the people are really, uh, I don't know if, again, if it's because we wear more time than we was expecting at home. And yeah. uh, white and gray, it's okay, it's neutral, it's nice, but it's freeze, you know, it's... it's yeah, it's, it's uh, sterile, it's, it's, it's not as, it's not correct. as, uh, not as warm and enveloping and, and homely. Correct, um, correct. So yeah, we're seeing, we're seeing uh, actually a lot of warmth come into the tones coming out of the mm -hmm. pandemic and, and people looking for something that isn't quite so sterile, that, that feels enveloping and warm. Um, so that's, that's really cool. Now, the last thing I wanted to just sort of bring it in uh, up with you is, uh, is that everyone always thinks, you know, backsplash and, and shower for tile. And I know that uh, for a long time, there's there's sort of been a lot of pet projects in Natuther with your creativity doing um, areas that you can use tile outside of tradition. Mm -hmm. um, things like your arch concept uh, program and the baguettes and things like that. Is that something that you're continuing with and seeing more um, upticks in this year? That is uh, always uh, what we are looking in Natuther is is uh, we have the possibility to make it a three-dimensional pieces for the system that we are using technique, it's extruded. So uh, we are developing large pieces, like as I mentioned to you before, like large steps of 48, 48 inches that mm -hmm. combine really modern with uh, the, the product we can find in the market. Uh, and of course, the three-dimensional pieces with, uh, with uh, like a tubes or things, three-dimensional pieces, like make it always something different. And, in our, in our mentality of not to share, it's really important the, how you can design inside of your home. As you mentioned, walls, backsplash, and, and floor inside. But it's, I think it's the same important, especially in places when you are living out of time outside, okay? Yeah, when this is sure. a sun side. So it's really important outside, okay? So we have it, all the particularities, all the pieces around that makes to you the complete set of, of uh, in and out. Yeah. No, and I've seen some fantastic projects that you've done with uh, like brisoles and, um, you know, exterior kitchens and, and uh, dividing walls and screens and gardens and landscapes. There's so many sort of capabilities for ceramic and, and it's easy livability that, that someone creating solutions like, like Natuser is, is so fantastic for the market. Same benches as well, as you remember, benches. Yeah. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. The be the public works benches and uh, so I mean the possibilities for ceramic are endless, and it's uh, it's it's always fantastic to talk uh, through what what we can do with you. Yeah, we so, try always. This is this is the the mentality that we have. It okay. Sometimes you have too many uh, ideas at, at the at the head, you know, and this is yeah. you must to clarify sometimes, but. Uh, always not to say we was looking for something different okay and this is our our focus always to make something unique different and and uh, try to play with sizes or colors you know or, or the techniques well from what i've seen in your novelties they look pretty exciting to me so i want to invite everyone to stop by and see jose and jose manuel at, at not to fair in the pavilion here uh at coverings or or stop by their website if you're catching us after the show online um, this is Ryan and Jose Cantavella from Natuther on behalf of Tile of Spain at Coverings 2021 in Orlando. Thank you very much, everyone. We'll see you for the next one.